In an exciting development for space exploration, Russia's space agency Roscosmos has extended a groundbreaking offer to BRICS partners, Brazil, India, China and South Africa, to collaborate on its upcoming ambitious orbital space station. The move comes after Russia's decision to conclude its long-standing partnership with NASA and a withdrawal from the International Space Station, marking a significant shift in international space cooperation. The Russian Orbital System, or ROS, is set to be launched in 2027, is a substantial project comprising several stages, with four modules planned for orbit between 2028 and 2030. Roscosmos Director General enthusiastically proposed the idea during a meeting in South Africa, urging space tech cooperation between BRICS nations to create a quote, fully fledged module through joint efforts. The Russian Orbital System, or ROS, is designed to initially accommodate just two astronauts, promising more extensive responsibilities and a unique experience compared to the ISS, making it an exciting opportunity for space exploration enthusiasts. Apart from the BRICS nations, Roscosmos says it is also open to cooperation with other countries, affirming its commitment to fostering collaboration beyond traditional partnerships. The race for space continues with China making significant strides. China's self-developed crew space station, operational since last year, rivals the ISS in module design and can host up to six astronauts. As China sets its sights on a manned lunar mission, it aims to become only the second country ever to land citizens on the moon, bolstering its position in the space race. India too has embarked on a bold mission to explore the moon's surface with the successful launch of its Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft earlier this month. India is said to become only the fourth nation ever after the US, Russia and China to achieve a controlled landing on the moon, slated for August 23rd. The international space landscape is evolving with Russia's ROS offering exciting prospects for scientific discovery and multinational collaboration. As the ISS approaches its intended end of life in 2030, new ventures like ROS and China's space station are paving the way for a thrilling future in space exploration. With these developments, the global community eagerly anticipates witnessing humanity's further forays into the cosmos. However, with India recently signing the NASA-led Artemis Accords for human missions to the space station, the moon and beyond, it remains to be seen if India and ISRO will join the Russian orbital system. What do you believe? Should India join Russia's space mission or stick with NASA-led Artemis Accords? Leave a comment below.